for this question, we're still working with the normal curve. You can see that we're using z. So remember what that means, that the mean is equal to zero and the standard deviation is equal to zero. So this is going to be my standard normal. Okay, and what that means is that the mean is equal to zero and the standard deviation is equal to one. Okay, so in this question, it's pretty much straightforward with what I need to do. The only curveball on this one is that this is a percent, so I have to convert my answer to a percent. It does say I need to be have between, so that's nice and helpful. Um, so let's take a look then at how we would type this in. So over here on the right, I'm going to use the top one. I want to make sure I say between. Standard deviation, mean and standard deviation are all set. So now I have to do is the negative. 0 0.818 and 0 0.818 positive. And if I hit enter, I get my answer. So notice my answer is 50.5866. So 0 0.5866. And then I have to do times 100 to convert it to a percent. And so that's going to give me 58.66%. Okay, so I want to make sure I don't type in the percent sign. So let's go over to my homework here and type this in. So I get 58.66. And let's do a submission. And it works. All right, on to the next one.